Week nine, we'll get underway then with the Cleave Hurdle. It's a three mile grade two. And it's a bit of a trial for next week's World Hurdle at the Cheltenham Festival. And at the top, we've got Dreaming Mist for Leon van Rensburg. Extreme consequences also for Leon van Rensburg trying to get back to winning ways after disappointing last time out. Cottage Wine, Craig Beckwith, Dance of the Animals, Joshua Sutherland, Empire Central, Stu Gray, Glamist. Alex Cherry, Rebel Run, Padre Hogan, Specky Garson, John Morgan, Yuma Exile, Vinnie Gerard, Zara Zeus for Padre Hogan, Dance Around the Stars, Joshua Sutherland, Gadebridge, Darren Thompson, Longbridge, David Dooley, Pink Bullet, Alex Cherry and Velvet Curtain for Martin Leland. They're off and running. Uh, heading towards the first. It's a lot that they've got to negotiate in this Cleve Hurdle. It's 12 that they'll take in all. They're already safely over the first. With Velvet Curtain coming through to take it up. Known front runner that one and goes into a clear lead of two to three lengths. And Dance of the Animals on the inside in second with Specky Garson and Zaru Zeus. He's also up there. And the leader is Velvet Curtain by about four lengths or so, getting over flight three. The Alex Cherry pair have moved through into second and third, Pink Bullet and Glamist. And Zaru Zeus, who's wide on the track, stable companion Rebel Run, just tucked in behind that Specky Garson on the rail, being tracked by Extreme Consequences. Looking towards the back, Long Beach is the early back marker, but they're racing downhill now towards the fourth flight. Um, Velvet Curtain's got a clear lead, setting a decent sort of pace from Pink Bullet in second. And Dance of the Animals on the inside is third, Glamist four, and Specky Garson in the light blue on the inside. The Padre Hogan pair together in the yellow. Rebel Run and Zaru Zeus. Extreme consequences on the inside with his stable companion Dreaming Mist. Just to go around the inside. The one that's going really wide on the track is Long Beach. The grey gauge, which is also quite wide. And Cottage wine towards the rear as well. But Velvet Curtain continues to show the way. Leading by the best part of four lengths to Dance of the Animals for Joshua Sutherland in second. Pink Bullet is third. Then Specky Garson on the inside of Glamist with Zaru Zeus and Dreaming Mist next as they take flight five. Which they're all over okay, but a couple of mistakes at the back from Empire Central and Long Beach. Racing then into the final two miles now. And Velvet Curtain. An undisputed lead of three to four lengths from Dance of the Animals in second and pink bullet third they're pretty set on one two and three dreaming mist has now moved through into fourth specky garson continues to race up the inside humor exile is one that's getting a little bit closer so to cottage wine as they make their way towards the sixth flight which will be the mid part of the jumping and will also be the final flight on the next circuit and we'll safely over that one with long beach Continuing to be the back marker, so they race up then past the stands and they'll swing out left handed now, then for a complete circuit off the track. And Velvet Curtain continues to show the way to Dance of the Animals in second, Pink Bullet third, and then Dreaming Mist in fourth. Specking Garton on the inside is five, and then Glamist is six with Cottage Wine getting closer. And then Zara Zeus, one who's dropped right back, his Rebel Run, that one was to the four earlier, is now right out the back with Long Beach. Only grey in the field, Gadebridge for Darren Thompson in the purple with the white sleeves is also nearer the back and the front but Velvet Curtain leads them over the seventh from Dance of the Animals Dreaming Mist going exceptionally well in third then Pink Bullet has dropped back to four Specky Garson is still there so is Glamist Cottage Wine is getting into that leading group Extreme Consequences and Dance Around the Stars have been sat quietly in mid-division for the majority of the race and Velvet Curtain He's still the leader, but only by about a length and a half now to Dance of the Animals and Pink Bullet, who are matching strides in second. Oh, and Velvet Curtain went right through the top of that hurdle and has surrendered the lead to Pink Bullet. So Pink Bullet goes on then now. And Velvet Curtain on the inside, trying to regain its equilibrium in second. Dance of the Animals is third. Dreaming Mist is for the field now, beginning to bunch up as they make their way into the final mile of the race. Velvet Curtain's come back to challenge Pink Bullet for the lead. There's no more than a dozen lengths first to last. Last is currently Empire Central. Velvet Curtain just in front, leading over the third last, but out jumped there by Dance of the Animals. Dance of the Animals then hits the front for the first time from Velvet Curtain and Pink Bullet. Dreaming Mist is still there, so is Glamis Gadebridge the Grey has got a nice run through on the inside. Rebel Run 
towards the back empire central the back marker but it's dance of the animals who leads by about a length as they swing left handed then there dance of the animals from gade which is just showing second then velvet curtain and dreamy miss pink bullet and glum is dance around the stars he's trying to get into it cottage wine still traveling well but dance of the animals is going to lead them into the second last flight from gade bridge in second dance around the stars the second joshua southern horse is coming around the outside velvet curtains under pressure the one that's coming really well now is humor exile in the green as they get over the second last and it's dance around the animals in the lead then from dreaming mist in second then gaybridge humor exile on the outside now rebel runner zara zeus are coming back into it as well and it's zara zeus who hits the front from stable mate rebel runners come from the back these two then now being pressed by dreaming mist then dance for the animals after that one comes gay bridge and also long beach is starting to run on as they race down towards the final flight it's zara zeus in the lead dreaming mist though he's coming to challenge on the inside gay bridge the gray looks a big danger they come to the final flight and dreaming mist hits the front dreaming mist then by half a length from zara zeus in second then comes gay bridge in third dance of the animals back in fourth over the final flight and it's dreaming mist and he jumps it well and gets away from it well and he's starting to pull away from them with a furlong to go it's dreaming mist who's putting this one to bed pretty comfortably racing up the hill and racing up towards the line it's an easy win for dreaming mist they're going to win this by a good five lengths or so from Zaru Zeus, who's probably just going to hold on to second, then Dunstan, the Animals, and Gabridge and Red Bell running in Long Beach, Humor Exile, all the way back to Velvet Curtain and Empire Central, who were the last two to finish. But whilst, whilst people have been looking at Leon Van Rensburg's other one, he sees it dreaming mist who now looks to be in the box seat for the world hurdle next week dreaming mist wins it for leon van rensburg zaru zeus for padre hogan was second dance of the animals joshua southern was third gadebridge for darren thompson fourth and beach for david hooley was fifth <laughs>